Hi guys, today we are doing a peach look. I mean, it's in the name, so just haven't used these colors and these tones for a while, so I thought it was time. You know, peachy, beachy summer, but definitely peach themed. I am just slightly filling in my eyebrows. I ran out of the e.l.f. brow lift, and I keep forgetting to like order more. So... You know I'm so minimal about my brows anyways. So that's about it. Okay, because I equate like peach with beach, um, I'm using a, just this tinted serum from L'Oreal. Um, I don't think you need a lot of coverage when you're doing this kind of look. I'm gonna do some light concealer, but I'm gonna dab it out with my fingers. Um, if you are wondering why I have so many band-aids on, I talked about it more in my last video, but I'm just really struggling with my dishydratic eczema right now. So, yeah. If you want more details, go find that video. Fingers are such a great tool, though, even though, unfortunately, I can't really use most of mine right now. I'm going to just set where I get a little bit more oily. Because if this was like my beachy outdoor look, I'm definitely going to get shiny in my T-zone. Okay, I know this seems weird and semi out of order, but I really like the combo of doing a powder bronzer with a liquid blush. I think the liquid blush kind of brings the life and dewiness back to your face, but I like that foundation of starting with the bronzer. So, yeah. I think it looks really good and also i'm not going to be doing like a bunch of different layers of makeup because again this is more of a minimal look so just a powder bronzer and a liquid blush and then moving on i could not do a peach look without using joy from rare beauty honestly one dot might be enough for me Also, I feel like I've had mine forever. They just last so long. Okay, we're starting to finally get some peach into the look. I'm adding half a dot more because I kind of feel like I have blush blindness. And I don't care, and I'm playing into it. Also bringing it over the bridge of my nose for that more like sun-kissed. Like, I've been out in the sun, and I'm sent, I'm like sunburnt in a cute way, look. Okay, I'm gonna use the Natasha Denona Retro Glam Palette. Cause it has some really beautiful peachy tones in here, just to amplify that. Okay, I'm gonna keep it pretty subtle, but I am gonna do a fun inner corner pop. And you know, you gotta flick it up. This is not the right brush. Okay, it, it got there. This is like literally the worst brush to be doing this, but oh yeah. And then of course mascara is a must. I'm just using the telescopic. This is all that I have been using these days. Okay, to tie it all together, I'm just gonna start with kind of like a, a nude brown. And then of course we're gonna add some peach. Okay, I actually couldn't find the lipstick that I wanted, so I'm just going to add some of this. It's actually a blush from Ciate, London. Just a PT well, blush. Oops. Kind of in the middle, and it's kind of working. That's my daughter in the background laughing in the other room. Okay, that's it. It's so simple. If you're gonna be do being outside, because I think of peach with like summery looks, you don't wanna have a lot of makeup on your face, especially if there's heat. But it's very cohesive, it's a little like monochromatic, and I love that, because everything just goes together and it looks good. I think peach is a color that looks really good on a lot of different people too, so. I think it's so cute. So here is, Princess Peach Peach look. 
Okay, and as usual, here it is with my lights. With no lights. Here it is with overhead lights. And here it is in natural lighting. I think you can really see the peach here, which I love. <laughs> 